see. Imagine now, in future years, when this young fella will eventually grow up and be walking out that gate, and he will then become another subject within the system. And unbeknown to him, that is occurring. The instalment of the instruments that we are seeing will capture the likes of me and my little boy every time we walk out this gate. And that is not a very nice thing to think about every time one or the other members along this street without any prior knowledge of what's occurring within their own community. cameras that's been um, installed on Ann Street and without any permission and it's in, it's in, it's in, and it's in breach of our human civil rights by the perpetrators who has installed these cameras which is an invasion of our privacy. It's been here from the early 60s. It was a reserve in here once and then that's been taken away and then been... It's not a communal thing anymore. It just becomes a state where we are being watched every time we move. And it's unbeknown to the other members of this community as to why this cameras are here. It was supposed to be for our own safety, but it's not. It's monitoring me now as we stand here in, in the things that I'm saying. As you see in the footage that's just been taken, and it's not very far from where I live. Would, would you have a look at this thing? There's only about four driveways in, and it's just there, and it's just uncalled for of having to see what I do and where I, what I, and where I, go, where I go and all the other people who will come here and visit me. That's my friend here now. Well imagine if this was pointing in, in front of our property which is Gulara Balu, it's on the other side of the street and that router that we've just been to, the cameras, is on the edge of the boundary and then if they were to be installed in front of our property, then it would be an invasion of our human rights. And, and what about the fact that it already is installed and it can look back on that law environment? What does that mean to you? It's very disturbing. So tell me about what is in that area that's significant and why it shouldn't be there. Well, in there we have a law ground as well. And in order for its discreetness, those cameras are interfering with our traditional way of life. So recognition shouldn't be facial recognition to facilitate the whims of those who are pointing those cameras at us. <laughs> 